Okay, so do you guys know who Rain Wilson is? You may know him as Dwight from the American version of The Office. Now, I'm sure that you all love Dwight from The Office. I wouldn't know. I've never watched the American version of The Office. I'm sorry, I just, I can't. I'm a huge fan of the UK Office, the original Office, and any other country's versions for me are just a desecration. Anyway, the point is, I'm sure you all love Dwight, the trashy, over-the-top, Americanized version of Gareth. I'm sure you love him. But did you know that the actor who plays Dwight, Rain Wilson, is a patronizing, holier-than-thou buffoon, a sanctimonious twat? Hey guys, so I've had a little thought turning over and over in my head. And now I've already got to interrupt him. Can you imagine if I started my videos with that energy? Oh, hey guys. So, I've been having this thought going over and over in my head. Mm. And look, I know we can all take a day off, but what is with his little sun hat collection? Hey Rain, the 90s called, and they also think you're a fat- Hey guys, so I've had a little thought turning over and over in my head, and that is about snooze buttons. Ugh, the self-satisfaction. Look at his smug little face. I've been having a little thought about snooze buttons. Wait, 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 I know what you're thinking. I'm normally much more profound than this. You're thinking, Rain, what are you talking about, snooze buttons? Give it a chance, it's an analogy. The concept of snooze buttons. My wife loves the snooze button. She'll set the alarm for 6.30 a.m. And she rolls over, takes one look at me, and goes, Fuck! This! <laughs> and hits the snooze button. And I, of course, will wake up out of a deep sleep and not be able to go back to sleep. And she'll hit snooze over and over again and then roll out of bed at 7.15 a.m. I bet he gives his poor wife hell about that every day. Setting your alarm for half past six when you only get up at 7.15? It's like you want me to fail. No wonder Hollywood won't cast me anymore. I look so tired. Why am I bringing up snooze buttons? Because it reminds me of humanity and climate change. Why am I bringing up snooze buttons? Because it reminds me of humanity and climate change. This is what we're doing as a species. We're just hitting that snooze button and kicking the can on down the road. Kicking the can on down the road instead of waking up. It's about time you woke up. See? Like my wife. Have you heard about Hurricane Otis over in Acapulco? Google it. Okay, Dwight. We will. <laughs> it went from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane. That is one. Of, that is the best line I've ever heard. <laughs> went from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane. Google it. It went from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane in less than a day. I was wrong. <laughs> I got it all wrong. This guy is the best. It went from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane in less than a day. It went from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane in less than a day. A hundred people are dead. I swear, I'm not laughing at what happened. It's just he keeps adding a little bit every time. You can't inform us about something that tragic with that voice and that cadence. And from a tropical storm to a Category 5 hurricane in less than a day. A hundred people are dead. Fucking <laughs> it's only Clifton. Extreme weather events that used to happen every thousand years are happening every hundred. That used to happen every, you know, hundred years are happening every five or ten years. Look, I'm no expert. Uh, on anything, really. <laughs> but I, I don't know if Dwight is right about what he's saying or not. I have my suspicions, but whatever. We'll leave them to one side, uh, shall we? Should we leave my suspicions over there somewhere? Uh, but uh, <laughs> as you should know, if you've been watching this show for long enough, I don't ever care whether people are right or wrong. Essentially, I care about what's motivating uh, people to say the things to do. What inspired Rain Wilson, eh, uh, to get on uh, Instagram today 
and bash us over the head with his snooze button analogy about climate change. Is it his overwhelming concern for the climate or is it because he's having an episode? Because I have a sneaking suspicion uh, that it is so the, the latter. The suspicions are back over here now. 80% of the world's oceans are in a heat wave right now, and 2023 is looking to be the hottest year in recorded human history. The list goes on and on. The list goes on and on. Well, then keep reading it, because I don't know what's on that list. You need to convince me what is with these people. They just read the first two things on their mental list, and they never continue. I need convincing, please. I don't need you to tell me to Google it, or give me analogies about snooze buttons. Feel patronized! Of course, this is all caused by heat-trapping gases like CO2 and methane that uh, create a heat blanket over planet Earth. Much like the blankets my wife lies under until 7.15 a.m., well, I'm left to lie awake with all of my disturbing thoughts. And um, what can we do? You say, how can we wake up? Well, the first thing you can do is educate yourself a little bit. I have this wonderful book, and there's a couple others by him. Paul Hawken. Mmm, that ought to stop those Category 5 hurricanes. Tell us how many books you've read about climate change. Regeneration, a uh, fabulous book. He has another one called Drawdown, uh, Practical Plans on What We Can Do. Get educated, learn about it, uh, be able to speak to the talking points, vote accordingly. So uh, read that book and remember to vote accordingly. Vote for the party that uh, Rain Wilson would like you to vote for. I can't imagine which one that might be. I bet the Acapulco Town Council are already setting funds aside for a Rain Wilson statue. And if enough people are passionate about waking up and not hitting the snooze button. And not hitting the snooze button like some people. Did you hear that you whore? Waking up and not hitting the snooze button, maybe some change can be made. Thanks for listening. No, no. Thank you, Rain Wilson. El Señor de los Vientos. El Santo de los Huracanes. I want to pay a mariachi band to do a song about him. How much would that cost? We need to make that happen. Ollie! <laughs> oh, Mexicans. Anyway, that's about all I have to say about this, so uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks, like, share, subscribe, all the rest of it. Do those things! I'll see you in the next one. Ha, huh. great.